Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith and this is your place for professional video production techniques. The subject of this reveal, understanding what the effects badges mean. Sometimes it's nice to know what a clip is doing before you have to click on it. Just by looking at it, do I have effects? Has it been scaled up or down? Or maybe both? While there's little indicators on both audio and video clips inside Premiere Pro right in the timeline to give you an idea of what they're doing. Let's have a look. So by default, you'll notice that these effects badges here are all gray, both for audio and for video. And by the way, if you're zoomed out a lot, you'll notice that they disappear. So sometimes I get the question, how come I can't see my effects badges? Well, it's probably because you're zoomed out a lot or you could have them turned off. So there's a setting right here, show effects badges. And when it's turned off, you cannot see them, but they have a great use. Gray means that there are no effects or intrinsic effects. Now, intrinsic just means built into every clip. So when you add a clip, Every clip has a scale, that's 100%. Every clip has a rotation value, which is zero rotation. It hasn't been rotated yet. So all of those are intrinsic and they're up inside here. So when you'll notice there are time remapping, opacity and motion controls. These are intrinsic, you can't remove these. And when you click on a clip that also has audio, then they have panning and volume settings. So these are intrinsic effects. Watch this badge here. You can see that it's gray. As soon as I do something like change the scale, you'll notice the badge changes to um, yellow. If I rotate this or change the opacity, it turns yellow. Anytime you make an indication or you make a change like that, you'll instantly see that change. All right, those are intrinsic effects. What about effects from the effects panel? I'm going to drag over this Lumetri effect and you'll notice that it changes to purple. Nothing has changed in the intrinsic effects. It's strictly just an effect. So I know this one has that effect on it. And if I actually add both, so there's a cinematic Lumetri effect and I'll change the scale and it's green. Green tells me both intrinsic and effects have been added to this. And the same thing goes for the audio effects down in here. If I change the level, you can see this particular one has changed to yellow because I've in, and changed an intrinsic effect. I bumped up the gain 1.8 dB. So you might wonder what those little things are down there. They're very, very useful. Uh, there was the ability to turn them off because some people didn't like them and they wanted them turned off. I have no idea why. I like them on. I like to be able to look down and know if I've got an intrinsic or an effect or both on a clip. So hopefully you found this informative. If you did, then please take a moment and click on the subscribe link to Video Revealed. If you're not already an Adobe Creative Cloud user, then get on over to adobe.com and download your free 30-day trial. Till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to get you looking your best. Mm -hmm.